Hello and welcome to this week's edition of our podcast. I am Raghuveer Sampath and I am Ratna Rathod bringing you our series on understanding financial ratios. Financial ratios are important tools that may allow investors to use data from financial statements and convert them into concise and actionable information. Each fiscal quarter, many of the large listed companies announce their latest financial accounts. And what better than to use financial ratios as one of the quantitative tools to assess the health of a company? In general, financial ratios can be broken down into five categories: profitability ratios, liquidity ratios, activity ratios, debt or leverage ratios, and market ratios. These ratios are created using a company's financial statements and could be used as one of the tools to evaluate the fundamentals of a business that you as an investor may be interested in. In this episode, we discuss one such profitability ratio called ROE or return on equity ratio. Simply put, this ratio measures how efficiently a company is using its equity to generate profit. It is calculated as PAT or profit after tax divided by shareholder equity. Let me explain this with a simple example. A firm with an ROE of 10% means that the company generates a profit of rupees 10 for every rupees 100 of equity that it owns. This ratio usually indicates how profitable the company is. As an investor, it's very important for you to remember that a company cannot be evaluated or analyzed using one ratio in isolation. Additional factors should also be considered. While there are many financial ratios, we shall cover a few basic ones in our series. This brings us to the end of our podcast, but it's not a goodbye. We want to stay connected with you through the week. So do visit us on the City Wealth Insights page for more market updates and analysis. We're going to be back next week same time same day with more